I just took a shower, hence why my hair is wet, and I'm doing some laundry, if you guys can hear that. I finished work about an hour ago, and I feel really cozy, and yeah, Jay is going to go get some meat pies for us for dinner because we finished work too late, and we have to go grocery shop, and there's just too much to do tonight for us to cook, so we're just going to get to-go food tonight. Alrighty guys, so I just got a package from Amazon and I want to show you guys what I got. So let's open it up. Okay, so I just took a shower and that's why my hair is wet, but um, let's open this up. I'm excited. I'm so confused. This is so like dramatic, the box. <laughs> Anyways, I got two cell phone cases from Amazon and I was not expecting it to come in a box like this. And then I also got this one here. So um, this one actually looked really nice. So they're both like whitish. You guys know my obsession with white. I love white. Um, so this one is, ooh, this is nice, you guys. So this one's like a white like silicone uh, texture and there's like velvet inside but I like it because it covers the camera so like it won't get scratched or anything which I thought was nice and I think it just like looks nice I don't know I thought it looked like really aesthetic so I got that and this was like pretty cheap it was like $20 I think Canadian so I got that oh my god it's so cold <laughs> and then this one is really dramatic like I don't know why it's packaged so extra but let's see i'm assuming it came with a screen protector because i don't know why else it would be so dramatic but i'm gonna get some scissors and of course my scissors are white <laughs> i love white you guys like i am obsessed with white but yeah so this was like i think 17 dollars. so this one was 20 and then this one was 17. i just like to switch out my cases all the time you guys know and i just get bothered when my case turns like yellow so yeah let's do the unboxing Ooh, this is so fancy you guys so fancy oh my god there's like stickers what is going on this is like really fancy oh is this for um the magsafe charger thingy i don't know and I think this is the screen protector. Yeah. As I suspected. Which is good, because I actually ran out of my screen protector. Because um, I do them myself, and the package that I had before had three of them in it, and um, I used all three. Uh, but this case is really nice. So this one, is actually like a um, clear one with a clear back. So it's like silicone on the sides and a clear back, which is really, really nice. Um, yeah, it's really aesthetic. I don't know why it's like really like, like it moves. Is that weird? Should it be doing that? I'm like really confused. I'm so confused. Why is it moving, you guys? I'm so confused. Anyway, so I have to read more about it. But yeah, that's what I got. I'm probably going to put this one on my phone right now. So this is how the case looks on my phone. I like how sleek it looks. I think it just looks really aesthetic, so... Yeah, I got that from Amazon. And then the other one I have to figure out still. I don't know what, what's going on with that one, but yeah. And then this is the other one. So this one is actually really, really nice. I like how it's clear from the back, but then it also has the white uh, like silicone around the um, case. So yeah, it won't get as dirty like a clear one would, but yeah, that is how my cases look. And yeah, I really like them. I'm actually going to keep this one. I think it looks really good. Okay guys, so I wanted to show you the case that I got. This is one of them. So 
Um, this one's really nice. I like the way it looks with the phone. And this is the iPhone 13 Pro Max. By the way, Jay's making yogurt. <laughs> you guys can hear like stirring. Um, but yeah, I like it. It's really cute. And I love white. Like white's just so aesthetic. Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. So it is currently Friday. I just finished work. It's 4.15. I have a nail appointment in like 15 minutes. Um, but I'm eating some yogurt, granola, pomegranate, and honey and bananas. I also do have self-tanner developing on me right now. So if I look crazy, that is why. But yeah, I'm just eating this really quickly before I go to the nail salon. I was my nails before. I'll show you guys a close up of them. But you guys, I'm stressed because the girl that I go to normally at the nail salon, she's like not working. Um, and she's taking the weekend off. So I had to book with someone else. And I'm stressed because you guys know me. I'm so OCD about my nails. Um, they have to be like a certain way for me to like them. So I really hope the person that's doing them, um, does it good. Um, it's really hard for me to find like a good nail artist that I genuinely like how they like, like they do the nails. Like I'm very particular with like my shape and stuff. So I actually filed them um, the way that I like them. So I'm gonna tell them to like not file them just to leave it at it as is because they usually like don't do the shape right. Um, and then uh, I'm probably gonna either do French again, depending on who's doing it or I'll do white to match my my toes. Um, just because I feel like white's easier and you don't really like mess up with white. But French, is, it could be kind of hard to mess up. So I'm gonna ask the person and see if like they can do it um, and then go from there, but yeah. And then, oh, I'm so sorry, after that, after the nail salon, we're gonna go to my parents' house tonight to chill with them. We're gonna have some dinner. Um, and I'll take you guys along. So yeah, if you guys wanna see how my nails turn out, I'm so stressed. And then keep on watching. So this is how they look. And as you guys can see, I file them very square. I don't know why, I just feel like this like suits my nails. I like my hands the best. And then, what's the other hand? I file them really short because I don't know, I just really like short nails. Um, and yeah, I'm just eating my yogurt parfait. But yeah, I also wanted to mention that I got a lot of feedback for my blonde hair, like me wanting to dye my hair blonde. Um, a lot of people said yes. Like the majority of people said yes, but a lot of people said no. And the people that said no had like bad experiences with blonde hair. And they were like, don't do it. You're gonna ruin your hair. You're gonna damage your hair. Um, multiple people messaged me that. And a lot of people like commented that on my video. So yeah, I don't really know what to do. I don't wanna damage my hair, obviously. It took me so long to grow out my natural hair. To be this healthy, so like I don't wanna like ruin it and dye it and bleach it. And then the maintenance and like upkeep of that, keep of like keeping it blonde it's just going to be stressful because like I'm going to probably have to bleach it and then it's going to take long for me to actually like get the desired like color that I want because my hair is so dark um and it is like box dyed so yeah that's where I'm at Bruno's crying at me because I'm not giving him attention and <laughs> he's so needy you guys but yeah um so that's where I'm at. I don't know what to do. I'm probably not going to do it. Jay does not want me to go blonde. He loves my black hair. He's like, I love it. Um, probably will stick to the black just because I feel like it's a lot of maintenance, as I said, and a lot of like bleaching and toning and all of that. And I just don't want to damage my hair. And it's so long right now. It's like literally like up to my butt. And yeah, as much as I would love to be a blonde, <laughs> I don't know, but maybe in the future I will one day. Someone was like, oh, get a wig. And I'm like, that's actually kind of a good idea. I could like try it out just to see like if I would like it. Um, Cause I don't even know if I would look good with blonde hair. Like I just know myself with like either brown or black hair. Um, mind you though, when I was in like grade 
seven, eight, I think it was grade eight, I had my natural hair color and then I had blonde highlights, like very, very blonde. If I can find a picture, I'll put it somewhere up for you guys. I don't think I have any, but my mom might have some pictures, but um, yeah, I was super, 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 super blonde, like very blonde and I didn't like it at the time. Like I did not like it. I did not think it looked good, but then it grew on me as time went on and then like two years later, I dyed my hair black and I've been black since, so yeah. I don't know what to do, but a lot of people said yes, so yeah. We'll see, I guess. <laughs> well, most likely I will not go blonde just because of all like the people that were saying um, that it's very damaging. So. <laughs> also i feel like i'm just like rambling in this video but since i am waiting for my nail appointment i might as well but i wanted to just say um i've kind of been feeling like unmotivated on my youtube channel because i feel like i don't really know what to post like i post vlogs but i feel like my life is just so boring that i don't really do anything it's like always the same video every week and I just, I don't know, I feel really like lost because I don't know what else to post. Um, so if you guys have any recommendations, let me know down in the comments. I just feel like all my videos are nails, like me going to the nail salon and then me going out to eat and then me going to my parents or Jay's parents or occasionally seeing like a friend or something, but I don't really vlog that much um, of that. but. Yeah, so I kind of just feel like unmotivated because I feel like, as I said, my videos are literally the same thing every time. And I don't know if you guys actually like genuinely like watching that. Like, do you guys want to see different content? What do you guys like that I post? What do you guys want to see more? Um, let me know because I don't know what to do. <laughs> um, but yeah, so there is that. I'm so nervous to get my nails done, you guys. Tell me why I have anxiety. It's so stupid. Like, why do I have anxiety to get my nails? I don't I don't know. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited though because my mom tonight she's making chibape. So it's a like Serbian kebab kind of. Um, and it's so good, and I'll show you guys, I'll vlog it, but I'm so excited. She made a lot of desserts too, so I'll vlog that for you guys as well. So yeah, I'll take you guys to the nail salon with me. Wish me luck. And hopefully I'm not crying after the nail salon. So <laughs> I'm so dramatic. Okay, bye. Alrighty guys, so then after that, I went to the nail salon and this is how my nails looked before she did the French. And yes, I did French again. And they honestly aren't too bad, but they're not my favorite, but they could have been worse. Let's just say that. So yeah. They're not too bad um, from far away, but when you look closer up, I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> but it's okay, they're just nails. And then I went to my parents' house, as I told you guys, and we had chivape, and it was so good, you guys. And then we also had so much dessert, you guys. Look at all this dessert. There were so many different options, and oh my god it just looked so good <laughs> it was literally endless like there was so much and i had a bit of everything and this is some of the dessert that i had so yummy and my brother's wife actually brought these cookies they're from her friend's business if you guys are in the ottawa area make sure you guys go check them out and yeah we also had some fruit and we obviously cheered yeah this is the fruit and i also wanted to show you guys my mom's bowl for bruno Look how cute it is. It's like a Frenchie Starbucks bowl. And yeah, that is it for today's video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.